Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can initiate a shared document review in which all participants can view and respond to others' comments. Shared reviews are usually more effective than email reviews if many people will be participating in the document review. The shared review process creates a copy of the file on a shared server location of your choosing, which allows others to comment and collaborate on the shared PDF directly. The shared file will be named the same as the original, but with an underscore character followed by the word review added to the original file name. To initiate a shared review, open the PDF to share and review, and then select the Send for Shared Review tool that appears in the Review panel within the Comment pane in the Task pane in order to open the Send for Shared Review wizard. This wizard poses questions to you on each screen. Answer the questions, make any choices that are needed, and click the Next button at the bottom of the wizard to proceed to the next screen. Note that if needed, you can click the previous button to return to a previous screen and change your answers. Now when you have finished, click the Send button to save the PDF to a shared location and send notifications to the selected users to review the file. Note that if you are publishing a document that already contains markups or comments, you will see a message box appear after clicking the Send button that asks if you want to publish the existing comments to the review server as the author. You can click yes or no in that message box as desired if it appears. Now Acrobat will save the setting choices that you make within this wizard into a sharing server configuration file that you can select from the drop-down that appears on the first screen of the wizard in the future to share another PDF using the same shared reviewing settings. That way you will only need to step through the wizard again if you want to share the file in a new way using a different server configuration. Note that to delete a saved server sharing configuration file that you no longer use, you can select Edit and choose the Preferences command from the menu bar to open the Preferences dialog box. Select the Tracker category that appears at the left side of the dialog box. Then select the Sharing Configuration to Delete from the Remove Custom Server Locations drop-down in the area to the right. Then click the Remove Server Profile button to the right of the drop-down, and then click the Yes button in the message box that appears to delete the selected server sharing profile. You can then click the OK button at the bottom of the Preferences dialog box to save your changes. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.